<sighs> Time for bed. What? Just as I thought, it's coming back to settle what it has started. Then that means I need to settle what I started. <laughs> he didn't see me. Are you sure you're fine, Mr. Seal? Of course, Morgira. I have my fluff, which means I shall be fine. Right? Well, then, good night. Look here! Huh? What? It's coming back. What's coming back, Vern? It is. What are you talking about, Vern? What am I talking about? I'll tell you what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the Ex-Verninator. Ex-Verninator? Yes. The Ex-Verninator. What is this Ex-Verninator? Oh. I was going to explain it to you too anyways. Because you would not understand what it was like. You see, last year, on this very day, I was going out into the woods to refill my stock of bark like every year. So many bark trees to choose from. So much bark and so much uh, bark and uh, so much bark. So hard to choose which one to start with. Hmm. Oh. You look like a fine candidate. Oh, no. You look like a better candidate. Oh, no. You look like the best candidate. You, no, uh, you, no, you, no, you, 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 you. Oh, it's so much to choose. I can't decide which one to pick. Uh, 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 uh. I knew I should have went with the first one. Hello? Is anyone else out here? Besides me? Must be my stomach. I am pretty hungry for bark after all. I need to refill my stock. There it is again. Man, I must be really hungry. Hey, whoever you are, this isn't funny anymore. Come on out. Stop scaring me. Maybe I should have said that. Oh no. And since that day, I have not gone into those woods. And that is part of the reason why I don't go out there anymore. And I never go on my yearly trip into the woods to get my bark stuck refilled. That's actually kind of odd. Watch. Odd. That's not the only thing that's odd, Vern. You're acting kind of overdramatic. I see. I see. Clearly now. You guys think I'm making this up. That's kind of it. I do believe you somewhat, but after hearing about that, I don't know. Maybe you just came across something like a deer or maybe even a bear. There's a possibility. I mean, they usually live out in those woods. No, Lugia. They are in those woods. The bears, yes, especially. But 
I saw the ex Vernier. Well, actually, I didn't see it, rather, I heard it, but I heard the ex Verninator. I did. Um, Vern, could you back away maybe a few feet? Oh, okay. But Lugia, all I ask of you and Mr. Seal is one simple task. That would be. Me. Oh man, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming! I knew this day would come, I think it'd be tonight! Oh. No, 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 no! By the sound of your voice, I thought you said you would want to exterminate the ex verminator You know, giving it a taste of its own medicine? I mean, that's what your voice sounded like. Not that you would actually want to do it, but hard? Yes, Mr. Seal. If you were out in those woods with me, you would understand what, how much fear I had going through my shell when I was out there. Look, how about this? We'll work out what we'll do about the ex there before it gets here. How about that? I'll help out too, just in case. Oh, thank you, guys. Okay, now, we do have some time before the ex Verninator gets here. It'll come here at midnight, sharp. What time is it now? Um... Two minutes past midnight. No, the ex Verner, his eyes were here. Hide, hide. Ow, 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 ow. Vern, stop it. No, I will not stop. The ex Verner, he's coming for me. He wants to make me into turtle soup. I do not want to be made this turtle soup. Let me in. Time. But see. Wait, did you say two minutes past midnight? Yes, I did. Then that means... Yes, it does mean that, Vern. It was probably all just your imagination. Hmm. Perhaps you were right, Lugia. You were right the whole time, probably. Maybe I was just... <laughs> oh, no! There's that sound again! He's coming here! He's here! Ah, that's his growl! I know it! I know it! Move! Move! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Move! Move! Wait a second. That wasn't the ex verninator's growl. That was her stomach! No. I recognize that growl from anywhere. And that was the ex verninator's growl. So let me ask you this. Are you hungry, Vern? I couldn't get to my midnight bark snack because, well, I was too tired. And that means... Okay, I wasn't too tired. It's kind of too lazy. Okay, Vern. I get that. But, however, if you're hungry and you heard that sound, then listen to your stomach. Oh my gosh! The ex Vernon Hair is in my stomach! Vern, what Mr. Seal is trying to say is that that growl you heard from the woods was your stomach, probably. I mean, if it was the same kind of growl back then, then it is indeed your stomach. You know what? You're right, Lugia. You were right. I must have been so distracted by all the bark in the area back then that I didn't even pay attention to my own stomach. And I usually pay attention to my stomach. Why else do I eat bark in the first place? Because my stomach wants me to. Thanks, guys. I will have my midnight bark snack and go to bed. Fare thee, Vern, well. Ugh. Oh, sorry, that was a bad try. <laughs> Help me get a boost, Wiki, huh? Wait! Ugh. You got to actually try, Lugia. <sighs> Fine. Weep. Now I can go to bed with a belly full of bark. Oh, nice and cozy. Oh, hey, someone turned off the light. Thanks. <laughs> nice try, stomach. You're not going to fool me this time. Uh, 
stomach? Was that you?